Hi everyone. Hi everyone. <laughs> <laughs> so we are in we are in Page, Arizona. We just made it to Horseshoe Bend, and how can I explain this to you? <laughs> Um, last time I came here was in October uh, and nobody was here but now it's August 17 August I don't know and it's like just the parking lot is packed actually when you see all the people walking it looks like little ants mm -hmm. <laughs> so our plan today is to go see Horseshoe Bend then we're gonna go to Lake Powell uh, swim there and chill a little because it's really hot outside right now. It's not even, it's 9 a.m. I think. And it's already very hot. Let's go! Just look at all these people. Don't film me, film this. So? <laughs> it's something. So we didn't stay really long to Horseshoe Bend, but guys, we just made it to Lake Powell and we found the perfect beach to just, you know, chill, swim and Enjoy the sun. You can literally come with your car on the beach, just park and go enjoy. So I think we're gonna enjoy a little bit here before taking the road because after we have to take the road to Salt Lake City and it's like five and a half hours. So it's 10.30, so we're gonna enjoy, relax. And I hope the water is not too cold though, but yeah. The water is so warm, but I'm really happy right now. This is perfect. We just made it to uh, Fifth Water Hot Springs. It's about, I'll say, an hour away from Salt Lake City and again last time I came here it was October so nobody was there it was very peaceful we had the hot springs for ourselves now I mean we still in, we, we are still in the parking lot and the parking lot is full you know I keep complaining about all the people but um, we didn't we didn't really have a choice of doing this trip in August because my brother I had to go to Denver for a wedding and I was going back home to Whitefish so we thought maybe I should join you in Denver and then do this road trip together as uh, he was planning on coming to see me in Whitefish anyway so that's why we're doing this trip in August where it's I'm sure it's the busiest season of the year but anyways I promise I'm gonna stop complaining but it's just we'll see how it is so I just noticed something very weird. Uh, the color of the water is completely different than the last time I came. I wonder why. Because last time I came, it wasn't clear water at all. It was very, uh, I mean, the color was blue. It was beautiful. Now the water is kind of transparent. It's so weird. I wonder why it's so different. We're in Jackson Hole. I'm so happy to be here. I love it here so much. It wasn't really planned on our trip to uh, come through Jackson Hole, but because it was just there and my brother really wanted to go to Yellowstone. So that's what we're gonna do today. We're gonna drive through Yellowstone and go uh, to Montana. So that's the plan for today. I'm excited to go back to Yellowstone. I haven't been since three years I think 
So we're gonna go have a little breakfast in town and then drive to Yellowstone. But before that, um, so yesterday I found this hotel uh, in Jackson Hole that is so cool. I showed you one in Lake Tahoe uh, in one of my previous videos. Uh, you know, it's those motel. It's a motel, but they just redid the entire thing and it looks so pretty. Now the room is a little messy, but I um, took some photos last night when we got here to show you how it looks like. So it's a, uh, I, I really recommend this place and it's not that expensive considering that we're in Jackson Hole and everything is uh, pretty expensive, especially in August and especially because the eclipse is in two, three days. So everything gets very expensive. It's called Mountain Modern Motel, if you're interested. So yeah, okay, let's go. Can't believe we're gonna eat this for breakfast. <laughs> we're sharing that. This is so big. Oh my goodness. Let's try this. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. That's good. It's sweet. <laughs> yeah, it may be a little too sweet for me for breakfast. But. We just saw the old faithful, faithful, c'est dur à dire? Faithful. Faithful. The old faithful. It was awesome. Uh, last time I came, we waited for 40 minutes and we never saw it. But this time we only had to wait 20 minutes and it was so worth it. Now we're going to, I never remember the name of that lake. Right. Do you remember right. the name then of that lake? Left old faithful road. Grand, um, grand. He's Midway Geyser Basin. No, it's called Grand... Oh, Grand Prismatic. Grand Prismatic? Prismatic? Prismatic. 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 <laughs> We're going there. The very colorful one. And then we have to start our way back to Montana because we still have a long drive to do. So let's go. completely forgot to film. Uh, I'm already in my PJ and as you can see I'm wearing my glasses. I know that none of you know that I'm wearing glasses but I do and I should wear them more often so this is me talking about the elephant in the room. I have glasses. Anyways we are back and we made it to Montana but we're still four hours away from Whitefish. Tomorrow we'll be back in Whitefish and I cannot wait because it's been two months, 
two months and a half that I left Whitefish. So I'm gonna end the video here. Thank you so much again for watching. I'll see you guys uh, very soon for the rest of the trip in Whitefish with my brother. Yeah. I guess that's it. Bye.